students? Can you hear me? If you hear me, please raise, raise your hand up. Hello, my dear students. Today, inshallah, we will start our O-level course. We will start with unit seven. How was your weekend? Let's start with a new vocabulary. Aquarium, sports center, fun fair, planetarium, football stadium, Bowling alley, museum, planetarium, football stadium, bowling alley. Museum, big wheel, nervous. Whale, team, statue, aquarium. Okay, let's see what is the meaning of each word. Okay, can you hear me? Please raise your hand if you hear me. If you share the screen, if you see the screen, please raise your hands up. Okay. Now, let's see what is the meaning of aquarium. If you know the answer, please raise your hand up. Omar Khalid. Can Good you morning, me? Miss. Good morning, Omar. How are you? I'm fine, thanks. Thank you, Omar. That, Can you see, uh, tell me the, the meaning of aquarium? Aquarium is a place who, who can and you see the fishes in, in, uh, in it. Yes, excellent, Omar. Okay, the aquarium is a place, it's an indoor center where you can look at sea animals or marine animals and fish living in water, okay? You can see different okay. kinds of fish. Yes, thank you, Omar. You're welcome. Okay, sports center. Sports center. Rahaf. Good morning, Rahaf. Good, no good morning, Miss. Okay, Rahaf. Uh, what, what is the meaning of sports center? A place where you can do sports indoors. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you, Rahaf. Okay. Okay. Uh, fun fair. What's the meaning of fun fair? Mm, Saif Dean. Hello, Saif. Hi, Miss. Hi, Saif. How are you? I'm fine. Okay. What's the meaning of fun fair? A place which uh, has a lot of games. Yes, thank you. Like what in Egypt here in Cairo? Uh, like park. 
Dreamborg, yeah. Did you go before to Dreamborg? No. No, okay. Um, type fun fair, a park with uh, fun rides and games, okay? Thank you. Safe. Okay, after this, planetarium. Planetarium. What's the meaning of planetarium? Lamar. Good morning, Miss. Good morning, Lamar. How are you? Fine. Okay, what's the meaning of planetarium? It is an indoor center where you can learn about the stars and planets. Thank you very much, Raha. Uh, Lamar, excellent. Okay. Football stadium. What's the meaning of football stadium? Noor. Noor Hatim. Noor. Miss R. Yusuf. Yusuf Ashraf. Yes, Yusuf. How are you, Yusuf? I'm fine, thanks. Okay. What's the meaning of planetarium? Planetarium? Yeah. It's a place that you can see stars and learn about it and see planets like that. Yeah. Excellent. Thank you, my dear. Okay. Football stadium. Ahmad Basuni. Ahmad? Ahmad, are you here? Okay. Jana Osama? Jana? Jana? Okay, Omar Khalid. Omar. Yes, I, please. I am with you. Okay. Omar? Yes, I am with you. Yes, Omar. Hello. Hello. What's the meaning of football stadium? Football stadium is yeah. a place who, who play football in, in, uh, in it and uh, the fans can sit in it. Excellent, Omar. Did you go before to the stadium? I won't, but I didn't. Okay, inshallah, we, you will go soon, bismillah. Okay, thank you, Omar. You're welcome. Okay, bowling alley. What's the meaning of bowling alley? Bowling alley. Malak. Malak Ahmad? Yes, Malak. The place where you can go bowling. Yes, the place where we can go and play bowling. Okay, thank you. Museum. What's the meaning of museum? Museum. Abdurrahman. Abdurrahman, Good yes, sir. Good morning, Abdurrahman. What's the meaning of museum? Museum. Uh... Uh, is a place where you can learn about history and uh, see the stitch. Yes, we can see statues, yeah, and uh, and uh, uh, exhibits, okay, exhibits there, or uh, coins, very good, okay. Big wheel, big wheel. Big wheel, Abdurrahman. Abdurrahman. Noor Hatim. Noor. Noor, are you here? Yeah. Noor, what the uh, did the um uh, what's the meaning of big wheel? Or where I can you see that. it? Yes? In the Okay, very good. Okay, Noor. Um, uh, nervous whale team statue. Okay, aquarium. We said it's an indoor center where you can look at the sea animals and fish living in order. Okay, bowling alley is a place where you can go bowling, canteen. A dining room in an office or building or a school. 
Fun fair, it's a park with fun rides and games like dream park, museum, a building to keep and display important things from the past. Okay, like Cairo Museum or Egyptian Museum, sorry. Planetarium, it's an, an indoor center where you can learn about stars and planets. The sports center, it's a place where you can do sports indoor. Stadium is a place where you can play or watch sports matches. Nervous means worried or frightened about something. If you are nervous or worry about the exam, okay? Here we will see an important expressions and prepositions. Talk about, if you talk about something or an issue or a subject, Ride on, not in, ride on the big wheel. I go on a ride at the fun fair. Look at the stars, look at, move to a new house, means to go to another house, a new house. It look, it took three hours to, to do something. Frightened of, make things the best solution for. Uh, take the bus to the city in order to, and plus infinitive. We put the verb in the infinitive, in order to do something. Quite nervous means he is quite or a bit um, uh, worried about something. At the end of, uh, it was a lot of fun. Work with, decide to do something. Make decision means to take the de uh, decision to do something. Okay, you want to do, you decided to do something. Age four, five means he he is uh, at the age of five years old. He is five years old. On the other side of the town, eat out to go outside and eat. Like be uh, being outside. If you want to go to another place or uh, an outside place like a restaurant, come home. And also we have some collocations, have breakfast or have lunch, have dinner, have juice, okay? Means here, eat or drink. We can also say have mass lesson, go swimming, go plus activities, okay? We put the verb ing. Go on a big wheel, go bowling, go to bed early, have a fantastic weekend. Go shopping, listen to music, have a haircut, meet my best friend, do different things, do the same things, do homework, do a sport. We have words and their opposite. Rise, fall, end, begin or start, sink, float. If you put uh, something on the water like wood, it, uh, Sink. If you uh, put plastic, for example, it will float. Nearby, far away, dead, alive. Okay, we have some definitions for some words. Alone means not with other people, lonely. Classical music, it's a type of music here. We have different types of music like classical music, a type of serious music played by like Mozart, Mozart is a musician. Coconut, large brown nuts. It's, it, it's difficult or hard to broke. Jazz music, it's a type of music first played by black American. Opera, it's a type of music where actors sing the words of a story. Pop music, it's a type of music Rock music, it's a type of popular music usually played with electric guitar. Sailor is someone who works on a boat or a ship, sink down, go down in the water. Terrible means very bad, okay? Or uh, very, it has a bad taste, okay? The, the opposite is delicious. Traditional, using ideas or ways that people first used a long time ago. We have also some words with their opposite, correct, incorrect. We put in at the beginning, regular, irregular, nervous, quiet or relaxed, 
friendly, unfriendly, dark, light, effective, ineffective, like, dislike, delicious, terrible, okay? We have also general notes in this unit, exhibition and exhibit. Exhibition, I saw an exhibition about dolphin, means a show for dolphin, exhibit. I saw a lot of exhibits in the Egyptian muse museum, such as coins and statues, okay? Here exhibit like coins and statues, okay? Go plus activity and the uh, ing at the end okay i went bowling i went to swimming or i go ball uh, swimming i go shopping she goes shopping every friday fun fair and fair what is the difference between them fun fair like dream park it's a place where you can play on uh, games or rides like dream park dream park is one of the most fantastic fun fair in cairo fair what's the meaning of fair like the book fair okay i go to the the cairo book fair every year here fair means uh, um uh, uh a show for books. Quiet, it's an adverb. She is quite nervous, means a bit nervous. Uh, frightened of, plus verb, ing or noun. He is frightened of the dark, or he is frightened of crossing the road. Like or love, plus verb, ing or noun. He likes going after likes or hate, love, enjoy. We put the verb ing or the noun. Okay, he likes going to the zoo. She loves flowers. Uh, I play tennis. Do you like football? I watched the football match yesterday. The tennis match I played yesterday was exciting. Hear and listen, hear, can the bats hear, listen to, also it's a verb, good students should listen to. After listen, we put to their teachers. Move and move to. Please move this chair away, Basim. Trees move in the wind. Move to yesterday, our family moved to a new house, means to, they went to a new house. They traveled or went to a new house. Okay, let's answer some questions. Choose the correct answer from A, B, C, or D. Number one, who can answer number one? Farida. Good morning, Farida. Farida. Hi, my dear. Can you answer Hi. the first question, please? Yes. Please start. The Egyptian Museum is full of an accent. Okay, thank you, Farida. The Egyptian Museum is full of ancient statues and coins. Thank you, my dear. Okay. Number two, thank you. Number two, who can answer number two? Mm. Yusuf Ashraf. Yusuf. Hi, Miss. Hi, Yusuf. Number two, please. The bowling alley is building where you can go bowling. The bowling alley is uh, the building where you can go bowling. Excellent. Thank you, Yusuf. Okay, number three, the third one. Who can answer number three? Fatma Sam. Hi, Fatma. Hi. Okay, can you answer the, first, the third one, please? Uh, the big wheel. The big wheel, See. excellent. Is one of the fantastic rides on in the farm fair. Number four? Yara. Good morning, Yara. Morning. Number four, can you answer it, please? No one lives in the Arctic. Arctic. Uh, Do you know Arctic. what is the meaning of Arctic? No. 
It's the North Pole. القطب okay. الشمالي. Yeah. No one lives uh, area? in the Arctic area. Excellent. Thank you, Fatma. Yara. Yara, sorry. <laughs> Thank you, Yara. <laughs> Welcome. Okay, number five. Who can answer number five? Abdurrahman. Basuni. Abdurrahman, yes. Abdurrahman, yes, sir. sorry. Sorry, Abdurrahman. Yes. <laughs> Uh, there are very old statues at Egyptian Museum. Thank you. There are very old statues. Yeah, at the Egyptian Museum. Thank you, my dear. Number six. Number six. Jana Osama. Jana. Can yes, you hear me, Jana? Oh, yes. Okay, number six, please. Summer? Summer? Read um, it, please, loudly. Summer 13 is in prep one, his uh, year. Yes. In th this year, summer is in prep one. Summer, mm -hmm. age or aged or aged. Or ages? Huh? What is the answer? Ages? Aged. Aged. Age. Okay. Yeah. Summer aged 13. Okay. Summer okay. aged 13 is, uh, she is in prep one this year. Okay. Number seven. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Jana Osama? Yes, miss. Okay, Jana, number seven. Mm, I went yesterday morning. I bought a lot of groceries. Yeah, I went? Shopping. Shopping, thank you, excellent. <clears throat> number eight. <clears throat> Ahmad. Ahmad. Good morning, Miss. Morning, Ahmad. Number eight, can you read it? Yeah. Okay. I did a haircut two weeks ago. I did. I did a haircut. I made. I made a haircut. Are you sure? No. Okay, so think about the answer. Head. Excellent, I had a haircut. Excellent, Ahmed. Thank you. Okay, number nine. Number nine, Noor. Noor. Can you hear me, Noor? Noor Hatim? Noor. Hi. Hi, Noor. Can you answer number eight, uh, nine? Three hours to drive for our old house in Kenya. Yeah. It? Spend. Spend three hours to drive from our old house in Cairo? It told or had talk spent. Oh. I can't hear you. Please raise your voice. Had it. It had three hours to drive from our old house in Cairo. You said spend or had. Had. It had, or it took, or it talked. Hmm.
Yes, I, can, I hear you. What is the answer, my dear? Hello, hello, are you with me? No more. Okay, Yara, can you know the answer? Yara? Yara Ahmed? Yara? Hi. Hi, Yara. I'm there. Okay. It took, uh, it took three hours to drive from, uh, from our old house in Cairo. Thank you, Yara. Okay. For number Hello. 10, Yara, please. For school, I always wear school. Uniform. Uniform. Thank you, Yara. Okay. Uh, number 11, Noor. Noor. Lamar. Lamar. Okay, Lamar. Hassan, what yes. to Cairo in 2019? Moved. Hassan? Moved. Moved. Excellent. Okay. Can you answer number 12, please? Yes. Okay. Our N is a dining room in an office building or a school or a canteen. Yeah, a canteen is a dining room in an office building or school. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Lamar? Lamar, مش كده? Okay. Let's uh, talk about the past symbol. All of you know the past symbol. We use um, in the past, yesterday, this morning, in and years, in October, last year, month, week, Tuesday, an hour ago, three days ago, okay? These are the time expressions for the past symbol. If we have regular verb, we put D or E, D or I, D. If it's irregular verb, we put the second part of the verb. Like the examples here, yesterday, our family moved to a new house in Alexandria. This morning, mom and I went shopping, went here, the verb, and moved, okay, to buy a new school uniform. Okay, they had watched a football match last weekend. When we make yes or no question, we start with did, okay? Did you visit uh, your uncle yesterday? If there yes or no question with verb to be, were you at the club last week? Was uh, for singular, was Mona tired a week ago? Okay, and this is the answer. If I ask with did, I will say yes or no. Yes, I did or no, I didn't. If we ask with uh, where you at the club yes i was or no i wasn't was monitor the week ago yes she was or no she wasn't okay and also in this unit we deal with speaking okay when i ask you about your holiday your weekend okay a nice day you got or a terrible day i uh, i say how was your weekend your holiday a day you uh, uh, enjoyed okay it was really terrible means very bad okay very good or very bad okay these are the expressions and also we talk about um, uh, musical instruments in this unit and different types of uh, music okay let's answer these questions wise people means the people who has um, who are smart or uh, uh, they are intelligent or have many information and experience in life uh, wise people make good shopping decisions or instructions equipment who can answer jana osama Jenna? Yes. Okay, can you answer it? Why is people okay. make good? Um, decision? 
decisions. Yes. Okay. They, they, they make, they decide to do things wisely because they are smart. Thank you, Jenna. Okay. Can you answer number four? I like driving, reading, riding, climbing on a big wheel. On a big wheel, like in, on, uh, in Dream Park. Yes? Reading? Reading? Let's you see. read it? See, riding. Yes, very good. Riding on. Okay, it takes on. Thank you. Okay. Uh, Ahmad? Ahmad? Yes, miss. Can you answer number five? Okay. Yeah. Please. We had... Terrible, we fantastic, have... interesting, wonderful weekend. I broke my left arm. A terrible. Excellent. Very bad. Thank you. Number six, yeah, Ahmad, please. Me? Okay. Yes. I sat next to a boy. Given, driving, ridden, called Samir this morning. His name is Samir, so he is, I sat next to a boy. Driving. Driving Samir, his name is Samir. Cold. Cold, excellent, Ahmad, okay, thank you. Number seven, number seven, Omar Khalid. Good morning, Miss. Morning, Omar. How are you? I'm fine. Okay, can you answer number seven? Of course. Please. When, when you put you a plastic? Put plastic? Yeah. Plastic ball in water. It yes. sinks. It uh, sinks. It sinks, floats, sinks. sinks. Yes, it's, it sinks. No, yes. it's wrong. It plastic. Floats. Plastic, float, okay. Float, 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 Not sink, okay. So it's a float. It's a float, not sink. Okay, sink is wrong. Okay, it's float. The plastic is light, so it float. But if uh, we put uh, a piece of food, it, it will be what? It will be. Uh, it will. Be float. It will. Float. Iron or wood. Sorry, iron. Sink. Iron, it will sink. Yeah, iron will sink because it's very heavy, so it will sink. But the light things like uh, plastic or wood, it will float. Okay, thank you, my dear. So sink is uh, a mistake. Sorry, okay. Number eight. Okay, can you answer it, please? Okay. Okay, my dear. I ate a football match two days ago. I watched. I watch it. Excellent. Okay. The, the, uh, number nine, please. What did you do last uh, Sunday? Excellent. Thank you, my dear. Okay. Number 10, safe. Safe. Hi, miss. Okay. Number 10, you're safe, please. It was a terrible day. Because. Also, because so, however, my team lost 5-2. Because, excellent, thank you. Okay, Safe. can you correct the underlined word here? What day was today? Safe. Safe. Um, sorry, Miss. Yes. yes. Sorry, sorry. No, don't worry, my dear. What day was today? Correct the mistake, please. Was. Is. Is. Excellent. Thank you. Number two, she listens to music two hours ago. Listen it. Paris. Okay, safe, thank you. Okay, listen, okay. Uh, Ferris, are you here? Ferris, 
Ferris? Ferris? Ferris, can you hear me? Okay, Lamar? Yes, miss. Okay, Lamar, number three. I like jazz and I don't like opera. Correct the mistake? I like jazz because I don't like opera. Because? Here is, a, here is a contradiction, a contrast. I like something, but I don't like something, okay? Here